Looks like both Von Miller and Mark Andrews are telling the Baltimore Ravens, cut the check! Yeah, this feels like a dream. And you know just what I mean. You see my boy, he like gotta made it, how to made it. Boy, he's a fan, and he like the Ravens, like the Ravens. And you know just what I mean. You two team keep it clean. You see my boy, he like gotta make it. So YouTube team keep it clean what's going on it's engraving here with another video and in this video money Mark Andrews who has been making his way around I mean the guy was just in a Pro Bowl doing his thing and then Super Bowl week he has been making his rounds on different podcasts and whatnot and he was recently on the Von cast which is Von Miller doing his thing and there's a clip that has been floating around where not only Von Miller but Mark Andrews as well they said that Lamar Jackson deserves not the same, not around the same amount, but Lamar Jackson deserves more money than Packers quarterback. Well, current Packers quarterback, because that could change, but more money than Aaron Rodgers. Let's listen. He does more than Aaron Rodgers. Oh, my like, God. He does, he does everything. He throws. He, does he does passes. Everything. He, do, he does everything, man. And they got Aaron Rodgers is getting $50 million a year. But you're speeding facts, man. He's a, like you said, like everything you said <coughs> is true, man. He deserves it. Um, he des deserves more, man. He's a, he's, he's, a, he's a fierce competitor. Every time he steps on that field, he's the one, man. Yeah. He's, he's the guy. Um, there's no one like him, you know, so he's a very special guy. And I, I know he's going to get paid. And um, I, I just hope that, you know, the deal gets done. Because I know the Ravens want to get the deal done. Yeah. I, and, I, you know, I, I think that, you know, you know, he wants to be a Raven as well. So hopefully both parties can get together to get that done. You know how it is, though. So before we listen to that clip, I told you all the what. And what the what was, was that Von Miller and Mark Andrews both said Lamar Jackson deserved more money than Aaron Rodgers. But after listening to the clip, you got to hear the why. The reasons why the breakdown, the simple breakdown too, which I appreciate it, on why they feel like Lamar deserves more money than AR-12. And they put it so straightforward and so simple because he does more. And however you personally feel about Lamar Jackson, whatever you feel like he does well, whatever you feel like he doesn't do so well, whatever you feel like he could improve on, whatever you feel like he does a phenomenal job of already, however you feel about Lamar Jackson, one thing that cannot be argued is that he is asked to do so much more. And then when you really think it, like really, really think about it, and you look at all 32 teams in the league and see what their quarterbacks are asked to do versus what Lamar Jackson is asked to do as the starting quarterback for the Baltimore Ravens, you could certainly make the case that he is asked to do more than pretty much every other quarterback. And when you think about that, like, let's let's just break it down in simple terms like they did as well. He's obviously the starting quarterback for the Baltimore Ravens. So what do you have to do as a starting quarterback? A starting quarterback, you drop back, you pass to your wide receivers, your tight ends, your running backs. You may scramble from time to time, too, but you got to get your guys the ball. That's your job. You got to throw the ball to all of your playmakers or not so many playmakers uh, that you have on the squad. Now, when you look at the, the playmakers or the receivers or the Baltimore Ravens, um, it is, it's not a job that a lot of other quarterbacks would be envious of when it comes to Lamar Jackson. They, they wouldn't be envious of his supporting cast. Uh, so Lamar Jackson has, because really, when, when you sit there and you go year by year by year by year by year, and you look at the supporting cast that the Baltimore Ravens have provided to Lamar Jackson, it's like, wow. Wow. Some of the names, let me just think of them off the top of my head. There's been Willie Sneed. Uh, there's been Seth Roberts. There's been Des Bryant, who was out of the league for two, three years. There's been Sammy Watkins. Twice. Twice. Um, there's been Hollywood Brown. That was, that was a nice one. There's been Rashad Bateman, and he's still coming along. I know he's dealt with injuries the past two years, but he's still coming along. There's been Miles Boykin. There's been Tylen Wallace. There's been James Prochet. There's been Devin DuVernay. Um, but when, when, when you think about it, and you look around at other supporting cast, and you look to, versus the Ravens, you're like, oh, oh, okay. Oh, that's, that's what they was asking Lamar to work with? And then the type of offense, too. Greg Roman's offense. Hey, running offense, amazing. Passing offense, 
left a lot to be desired throughout the years. Started off hot, started off amazing, but well, you know the rest of the story. Uh, Ravens didn't do enough to capitalize and, and build off of what they started in 2019. But that's a whole nother conversation for a whole nother day. So, again, that's Lamar Jackson as the Ravens starting quarterback. That's what he's asked to do, and that's who he's been asked to do it with. Oh, and I forgot Deshaun Jackson, 35-year-old Deshaun Jackson, who ended up getting signed to the Baltimore Ravens because he went and talked about them in a positive way on the podcast. So that's what the Ravens have been doing now. He's also asked to be Baltimore Ravens leading rusher. He's asked to be their top rusher of their running attack every single year. So not only do you have to be the top passer, you also have to be the top rusher as well. Yeah, that's a lot. And it'd be one thing if like, his rushes and all the rushing yards that he got, it came off of him just scrambling or something. It came off of broken down pass plays or something like that, but uh, it doesn't. And not to say that it's so bad or whatnot, because obviously Lamar Jackson, he be making stuff happen. But he's asked to make stuff happen, and he does it for both the passing game and the running game. So when, you, when your job, when your job asks you, hey, can you take on task A? You say, okay, cool. I, I, I'll do it. That's, that's my job description. I, I'll take care of that. Hey, can you, um, can you take on task B as well? Can you, can you take on that too? No, normally, we don't really ask people who take on task A to, task, to take on task B, but can you do that as well? You say, oh, uh, okay, sure. I got you. But am I going to be compensated for it? Are you going to take care of me with it? And then they'd be like, ah. Uh, We'll think about it. We'll, we'll talk. We'll talk. But in the meantime, take care of task A and take care of task B. Thanks. Got it. Bye. So that's what the Baltimore Ravens have asked Lamar Jackson to do. So initially, when you hear somebody say, or maybe not even initially, but when you hear, oh, Von Miller or Mark Andrews, they say Lamar deserves more than an Aaron Rodgers. Some people could say, what? Are you crazy? There may be some people that be like, hey, buddy, I don't think so. Lamar Jackson don't deserve that. Simply let them know, hey, look at what Lamar Jackson does. And again, like I said earlier, with who he does it with. Take Uber, for example. Say, for instance, Uber reached out to you and they said, hey, we want to hire you. We will provide you with the car. All you got to do, pick up customers, take them to their destination. You're like, OK, cool. It's a job. It's Uber. I'm looking for work. Got it. You say, All right. So, you know, some other Uber drivers we're getting paid certain amounts and whatnot, but they they got the Cadillacs and whatnot. They got the BMWs. They got the Mercedes. They even got the Teslas. They got all the, 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 the fancy cars and whatnot. And you're like, all right, ooh, that's nice. I like that. I see you, big dog. Hey, I, I like it. All right, Uber, what, what you hooking me up with? And Uber comes to you, and they say, here, you know what? We got you. We want you to do the same job they're doing, but... We are going to give you a 1991 Honda Accord with no AC. But we want you to do the same job they're doing. We expect you to get the same results that those guys, those other Uber drivers are getting with that 1991 Honda Accord with no AC. How would you handle that? That is with what it is with Lamar Jackson. That's what it is. He's asked to do the same thing that a lot of these other quarterbacks are doing and, and more. But he's been provided less. So why should he not be compensated more? Why should he not get top dollar? Why should he not get his bread? I can't think of any reasons why. Yeah, this feels like a dream. Like a dream.